What's happening, everybody? It's your old pal Boogie Bob. That is the Christmas tree right there. Lots of scaffolding on top of that thing. It's uh, 12 stories tall. They're getting ready to, they're stringing it with lights and they're trimming it. Behind me here is uh, Saks Fifth Avenue. And uh, right here is a Zamboni. And uh, that is the rink. I'm actually going right there right now because I have an appointment to do a walkthrough because we're actually doing the Christmas tree lighting again this year. We did it last year and my company is in charge of the coat check here. So it's going to be pretty cool to uh, try to figure out how I get down and meet her. Uh, I've got to get through security and uh, uh, there's no one. I gotta get down here. Let's see if I could talk to this guy and get through. All right, so the guy said to uh, take the elevator over here right down to Nero, and that's what I'm going to do. Guys, this is the rink. That's the Zamboni guy. He doesn't get the props he deserves. He's the one that makes it all nice and skatey. Uh, there's a beautiful statue. I'm gonna walk over here to this elevator and I'm gonna take it downstairs to Nero and then I'm gonna do a walkthrough and I'll be able to take you with me because I need to film the logistics from my business partner. I'm gonna take this glass elevator right here to Nero. N-A-R-O. That is the ground level elevator. I'm going to pull this handle. I'm going to push this button. Boom. And I'm going to wait for the elevator to come up. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Here it comes. How do we get out? level I think we're going to uh, where the hell are we going guys uh, I guess we're going to shops and dining this is where I'm going to narrow after you guys uh-huh so as you can see it's a damn city down here it's huge and this is where we did uh, the uh, Christmas tree lighting last year. So I want you to picture shrimp, lobster. It's so gorgeous. They got all these tables set up. And they'll have a bar right here. And while there's 100,000 people out there fist fighting for a view, I'm right here below the tree. It's insane. Over there is even a better shot. Uh, so I'm going to... Uh, Find out where the hell narrow is. It's like a damn city down here, bro. I'm lost. Yeah. Can you call yeah. a cop to figure out where I'm at? The ant farm down I'm here. I'm trying to find narrow. Tell me how you're, I get there. You're right there. Oh, great. I'll so that way. Those gray doors, and uh -huh. you'll walk right into it. Thanks, man. You're welcome. Have a good one. You work in the Christmas tree lighting? Yeah. It's going to be busy. I'll see you then. Later. Look at this. How cool is that? Instead of I Love New York, they got the statue. I Statue New York. This is the, uh, the gift shop for the rink. How cool is that? All right, uh, I, I want to come see this, but I got to gotta meet her at 11, and I'm never late for stuff, so I'll... Uh... I went the wrong way. It's a city down here. You go, girl. Look at her. This ain't her first time on skates. That's a professional right there. All right, do a little uh, spin and flip for me. All right, narrow, right here. I'm going to uh, be back in a second. This whole area, this is the buyout, right? So there's all going to be 
yes, last year it was. You couldn't barely move your elbows in here. And uh, it was huge. And I think that the space for coat check will be here. Okay. Will you have like uh, drapes and curtains or pipes and curtains and stuff or uh, just racks? I think just racks. We'll try to do drape and pipe. Okay. Uh, so it's right in between the escalator and five acres. Okay. <laughs> My colleague Einstein just running a little bit. Okay, late, that's fine. Let me know that it should be between this. Yeah. Five acres will be close. So it's okay. Oh, going five to, acres will be close. Will be close. Yes, okay. So no one will be here. So I presume that it's this hallway uh -huh. or it's this area here. But this is less likely just because it's just going to block the. Is way. there flowing? Are they coming through? I think so. Yes. It'll probably be this then. Yes, because there's two. It's very hard to have ours. code check if they're flowing through. That's yes, a nightmare. Yes. So ours is for NBC and the other one will be for Tishman Spire. So I. I'm pretty sure that the coat check is going to be here, but it's so we'll like hand, it's we'll good. handle coat check for you guys, no, not for that. No, no, no they just, got just great. For us. They will great. have their own. Yeah. Okay, and so, I guess you'll have the rack set up here, maybe yes. some tables for bags or yes. whatever. Yes. And if uh, some tables, maybe some shelves or ideally, kind of like a ideally, if you have a table here, right? Yes, and please. my guys are here. Are, are the, is this how the uh, the guests are going to come through here? I think so. Probably. There's, There's no way to get through so there, right? Yes. Specify where the code check is. Uh -huh. and I feel like this would be a good area to just set up the racks. Okay. Does this stuff open, or is no one's in and out? That I'm not sure. Okay. We'll need to... Yeah. So if we and ran, I will just write it down so I can ask all these questions because okay. I'm also. I'm, I'm also filming for Nadine because yes, I I'll yes, get home yes. and she'll yell at me that I didn't do it right. So maybe so. you want to uh, film all of this area. Yep. And just specify that the code check. Right now is designated for the space yeah, yeah. between the escalator and five acres. Great. So it should be here. Yeah. If you had a table right there where two or three of my guys can check at the same time, we'll have no line. Because you don't want to come to this place and have a line of eight, 80 minutes. And then we run some racks down that wall and then we'll have plenty of room for bags. And you're saying that the five acres will be closed, right? Yes, five acres will be closed. Do you know how far back we have? We have that whole area back there? That is I don't think we we'll need, need it. Confirm, yes. Okay, give me one but sec. All right. So he's thinking that this will be us and this will be closed. This is called five acres. We're between the, uh, the five acres and the escalator, but this would be a huge area. We could run bags all the way down this wall here and then if we have up, let's just say we had only to here. If we had just from here to there, I think that's pretty damn big. That's one of the biggest coat rooms we've ever had. This would be perfect. And there's no running. Last year we had to run a mile to, to do it. So if this is closed, yeah. So this thing for sure is closed. Yes. And you don't know what's going on back here? Because technically, Grisha, if you put a table here too to just block it off so no guests could get in, that's this would I'm, be huge. This, we don't thinking. usually get a space this big. Right. Usually they put us in a little shitty closet somewhere uh -huh. and then they say, okay, you got 500 people coming. It only holds 80 people. Well, it, this. This is a mechanical one, so I don't know if okay. we'll like, we be able to like, take the entirety of the space, but I will. All right, Nadine. So narrow is this restaurant here. And as you can see, the windows for narrow overlook the rink. It's literally right here on the damn level. Look at this. I don't know. Can I go out? Is it locked? I think it's locked. But so the rink is right here. The tree is right above us. Uh, Nero is the restaurant here. By the way, the guy is the nicest guy in the whole world. Grisha, wonderful guy. And then, here's where we'll be ch doing the checking. There'll be no running. Remember, Nero's right there. And there's an escalator here and some steps. And then the name of this restaurant is called Five Acres. That's because it's five acres down here. Look how big it is. And so there's the escalator. 
there's the steps and this would be us it's perfect this will be closed so they'll put a table here this is fingers crossed stays like this he said it could change but put a table here have you uh, Darnese Tasha checking coats here and then this is our area look at how big it is we can run racks all the way down that wall we can run bags all the way down this wall uh, on tables and then I don't know how far back it goes I don't know if any of this is open there's the Amazon store but even if it just goes to here and they put a table here we got this whole area here that's a huge space no running like last year the good news is you guys can see the tree over here just you'll be checking here and you'll be able to literally walk 20 feet to look at the tree throughout the night uh, it's called five acres because it's absolutely massive down here this could go down as one of our best parties ever so you can see that it's uh, pretty massive down here. More, we're on the rink level, so you could look there and you could see uh, Saks Fifth Avenue. Pretty cool, uh, but it's really huge. We're right next to Five Acres. Okay. All right. It's going to be an amazing event and i will make sure i bring you guys with me i hope you had a nice time doing a walkthrough for narrow and for the christmas tree lighting It is huge. Last year we checked coats like down that hallway and then we ran them all the way to the back room back there. We're not doing that this year. This, this year we're literally checking right where we're standing. So it's going to be pretty amazing. Uh, once again, there's Nero, the restaurant. By the way, Nadine, he invited you to come eat anytime you like, which was crazy because you'll do it. I said, don't do that. She'll do it. It's uh, really beautiful in there. You can see the uh, sign for Nero there. And uh, it's our new location. And there's the rink. And there's kids learning how to ice skate holding on to the penguin. You got to hold. Look at it. Is she having fun or not? This is the famous roller rink, the ice rink. It's a roller rink in the summer. It's an ice rink in the winter. Hey, ladies, how you doing? And uh, Christmas trees right there. People will come from all around the world to see it. And we will be standing here enjoying the hell out of it. Definitely wanted to come back. And this is the rink store. And I wanted to show you guys some of the merch in the rink store. They've got these beautiful hoodies, and it's got the uh, statue of Prometheus. I love, I Prometheus New York, and I'm going to guess that's $85. It is $64.95. It's a child size, so that's why. It would have been $85 if it was an adult size. Super cute hats. Look at this. Rockefeller Center hat. Ooh, I'm going to get some for my employees. That would be super cute. The rink. They have the book. Good night, Christmas tree. They even got little Christmas trees here. Uh, I tell you guys, the cups are always $12.95. Here they are $20. There's the... Uh, statue and there's people there's a owl an owl ice skating and then they have uh, lots of socks a coloring book 
That's Atlas. They've got bathrobes and scarves. And this owl is, he's appearing everywhere, so I don't know what his significance is. You know what? T two years ago, they brought a tree in. That's exactly what happened. They bought a, brought a tree all the way from upstate, Pennsylvania, wherever, Connecticut, Maine, wherever they brought it from. They came down, they set it up, and um, a day later, they found a baby owl living inside the tree. Uh, that's a fact. That's where the owl came from. Got Christmas ornaments. Christmas trees. You got snow globes. Look at this. Oh, this ain't your daddy's snow globe. Very pretty. And a beautiful, beautiful statue, Rockefeller Center. Got the center in the background. And then they got shirts. There's a big ass polar bear. He's got the gift bag and the scarf and the hat. So and uh, super cool. I'm in the rink store, folks. And then she sells you the tickets if you want to go ice skating. And here's some deer. And uh, this is the candle. The apo, apotheki. Apotheki. Wow. I wish you could smell that. It smells delicious. And here's the old dude skating on the rink. Look at this. He old school with it. He old school with it. Looks like Colonel Sanders. Look at this. He's proposing on the ice. Don't do it. Sorry. Look at the people. Look at the people. How beautiful is that? He's, he's proposing on the ice. How romantic is that? I hope they're still together. Season's greeting. Ho, ho, ho. And uh, the little owl. I'm going to tell you the story of the owl. Roxy is the owl's name. In 2020, a tiny owl settled into Rockefeller Center's Christmas tree and stole New Yorkers' hearts. She returned to upstate New York, raving about the Big Apple. On her journey, she was robbed in Jersey. I told her not to go to Jersey. But there it is. Uh, her name is Roxy. Roxy the Owl. Very cute. There's the store. This is a Rockefeller ice rink store. How cute is that? Alright guys, we're gonna get up out of here. I gotta figure out how to get the damn elevator. I feel like I've been kidnapped. Alright, this is the elevator right here. I've been walking around for 30 minutes trying to find the damn elevator. Ice rink, right outside the door. That was a very good walkthrough. All right, I'm going up. Excuse us. That's okay, thank you. Whoop, uh-oh. See if I can figure out how to get the hell out of here. Street, we're going to the street. Yes. All right. Yeah, they, they, just fly, they fired the elevator operator. See? The they just them out. Yeah, got <laughs> lost on the way. Oh, here we go. I was feeling a little claustrophobic. I was trying to find mm -hmm. this elevator for like 40 minutes. All right, so I'm back on the street. Uh-oh, cops, everybody shut up. Guys, that was a tour of my new location uh, downstairs it's narrow guy even invited me and Nadine to come and eat and uh, we were filming to how I'm gonna set up the location but I want to show you something before I get out of here 
This is the Christmas tree. And you can see it's like 12 stories. It's got a bunch of scaffolding around it. And they're working hard up there. It's going to be a million, million lights on that thing. But right here, guys, this is FAO Swartz. It's the greatest toy store in the world. What people don't realize is that FAO Swartz has a second floor. And if you go up where that lady is, up on that second floor, you can actually look out and get a better view of the tree. So when the scaffolding's gone and the tree is up and there's 8 million people standing right here trying to look at it, make your way in and go look at the tree. Look at the tree from the second floor up there. By the way, on the second floor, Tom Hanks, the piano he played in Big, the one on the floor where he plays, it's right there, right behind that window. Also, the guy with the greatest beard and mustache in the world, I've never seen him not smile. Year after year, he's right here. I've never seen, I've never seen you not smiling. You're a good person. All right. That's FAO Swords. Thanks for dropping by, guy. Oh, sorry, sir. I'm sorry. So, sorry, guys. You just wanted to walk right out in front of me. Thanks for stopping, guys. Please be kind and loving to each other. Look at how many workers they got here. They got 100 workers. All up there. Trimming the tree. Right now they're posing for a picture from this guy. This is Rockefeller Center right here. One thing you might not know is that these guys are not only stringing lights, it's a huge tree, but they're also trimming branches and you see the branches there. Many of those branches will be used for making wreaths and other Christmas items. They don't throw any of it away. Those will all be used for making wreaths and other things uh, related. You see him carrying tree branches. Uh, it's a, it's lunchtime. These guys are gonna go eat lunch. That's a big job. Right there is St. Patrick's Cathedral. Thanks for tuning in. God bless you. Please be kind and loving to each other. I'll talk to you later.